In this video, I want to describe the advertising requirements for the stream of low-skilled occupations where you are offering either a high wage to the worker or low wage uh, for the worker. And what I just want to summarize in that is the low-skilled occupations are for NOC C or D. And when I say high wage workers or low wage workers, I essentially mean um, if you're paying higher than the prevailing wage or lower than the prevailing wage. Um, so the recruitment requirements or the advertisement requirements are somewhat the same. They both have to be posted on a national or provincial job bank um, for at least 28 days or four weeks and must, be, uh, must remain posted until the LMIA is issued. So after the four weeks, you can, you can essentially gather all your documents and submit it with Service Canada for a labor market impact assessment. However, keep the posting up because when the immigration officer assesses your application, they want to see not only the posting, but that it's still posted and you're trying to reach out to Canadians. The other thing that's important is that the two sources have to be advertised where one of them has to target an underrepresented uh, group, which could be uh, minorities, could be women, could be youth. Um, any underrepresented group still needs to be targeted as part of um, the, the application. In addition, there is um, a transitional plan that should be included in the application. Um, and you can look into the video where I explain really what a transitional plan is and how you could execute a successful transitional plan. Now for the low wage workers, if you're doing that, um, you also want to watch the video that describes the cap on low wage foreign workers because um, there is some calculations that are required. But going back to the advertisements, they essentially remain the same whether it's the um, whether you're doing um, above the prevailing wage or low below the prevailing wage, you still need to ensure that it's posted for four weeks, a minimum of two places where one of them is targeted towards an underrepresented person. If you have questions about how to uh, successfully post a position on any of these job banks, feel free to contact us. We'll be more than happy to assist. Thank you. Until next time.